Okay, here's an update. Saturday, the 26th of November, 2022. Uh, here's a uh, grape tomato. It's just hitting the top. On this um, plant, I just do these, propagate these guys from a cutting. And normally they have a double truss of fruit. Uh, and then they have two sets of leaves and then another truss of flowers. And then another two sets of leaves, another truss of flowers. This one's a triple truss. So there's three there. Normally it sort of has a lot of double trusses. There's a double there. You know, it's right up to the top, so cool. And then uh, this is another grape tomato here, the same plant cutting of it. Plenty of uh, more fruit. Um, this one is a um, heirloom Italian. Somewhere there's some fruit here. It's an heirloom Italian one. And another grape. And then uh, gross list. This is a gross list here. Oh, it's starting to get fruit here. Um, so there's five tomatoes there. Then the Hungarian wax peppers up the back. Oh, yeah, so I finally planted all this. Hungarian wax peppers in those two drums there. Then um, silver beet. There's two okra there, I just planted them today. This is a jalapeno chili. Lots of chilies on here. Peppers, they're gonna come on. We've been eating some of these and giving some away. Um, zucchini, zucchini there. Um, so plenty of flowers coming on this one. That's good. Um, this is tomato here. I trimmed all the tomatoes up today. So this is gross list. And these are all gross list actually on that row. There's five there. And um, this is a Macedon, I've trimmed these up too. This is a Macedonian heirloom tomato. We're just starting to get some fruit, oh, some flowers there. So we'll see what happens. And then that's grape. That's an Italian one and another grape over there. And then uh, there's two, two um, bell peppers in here. They've got fruit on them now. They're coming on. And then two zucchinis here. So plenty of zucchinis. We've been eating them and giving them away and trading them and etc. etc. So they're good. Zucchinis, you beauty. Um, lots of lettuces in the in this pipe system here. So it's like uh, an A-frame. These are icebergs and these are just, I don't know, some kind of frilly things. A bit of a mix here, there's cos. More, those three there are um, icebergs. So that, this, um, this pipe system and these two wooden benches here all run on the one reservoir. They run non-stop all the time. And then over here is the corn. It's in this flood and drain bed. So it'll be three weeks today, and they're, um, they're growing really well, looking good. It, this is like five inches deep of quarter inch gravel. Floods every three hours, and the uh, reservoir's down there. Same thing, I'm running the EC at about 1.8 to 2.2 pH, about 5.8 to 6.2. And so they're looking good, they're going to be great. Uh, over here, over here on this, um, so my dear wife has made a bunch of pesto this week and we still got, she's hardly made a dent in them. So, and these are coming on, these are more sweet basil in the pipe system, so that's where it's flowing from. It flows along there to the end and there's a uh, plastic card in the there to keep the water level up to the bottom of the net pots and it falls down, comes back down here. That's a uh, Thai basil. I like to have them in there because they flower and the flowering plants bring the bees in. And there's a the reservoir looking pretty dirty. There's a scrub, I think. And on the same reservoir over here, that's um, silver beet. These are 
rock melon or cantaloupe. And these are also rock melon and cantaloupe here. We're just, um, just climbing up this netting, looking pretty good. And the, yeah, so there's four of these buckets of uh, cantaloupes, rock melon. These will be really good. They do really well. I and mean, then this, these last three buckets have got um, cucumbers in them. So we've got heaps of cucumbers now, heaps and heaps. These are only like sort of short ones. And, and there's so many, we just keep taking them off. There's plenty everywhere. And um, yeah, so that's that. And I've just trained that up this wire mesh and it's all doing pretty good. Over here we've got more lettuces, I've planted some up. And these are red onions. I'm going to um, probably put them out in the aquaponics bed when they get a bit bigger. This is a Vietnamese mint. It's really easy to grow, really easy to propagate, like all mints. Um, that's it. Dirty old reservoir, I might get a scrub tomorrow afternoon, I think. That one over there. This one here is pretty good. And that's uh, the stuff here, so you can see again, you can see the bell peppers. There. Tomatoes, heaps of tomatoes coming. Rockies are going to come. Uh, heaps of cucumbers at the moment. And tomatoes. Doing good. Thank you. It's pretty a web. What's she doing over there? She's got something in that web. No? <laughs> My wife hates that's a um oh, what is that? That's a gold I think that's a gold norm. Pretty nice spider. She's spinning a web for the night. Doing some hunting. Cool.